you guys want to support this truth, you're welcome to do so. The donation links, cash out link, and PayPal link in the description box below. Alright, so Prince Marky D, you know what I'm saying? I won't be too surprised if this guy was responsible for the other fat boy dying. You remember the other fat boy? The big, big one. The one that was really in charge of the human beatbox. You remember? Because it was only one that was really into that human beatboxing day. And that was a big, big one. And he died not too long ago. I think like a two or three years ago. I remember doing a report on him. And I won't be too surprised if Prince Marky D is the one that's responsible for his death. You know what I'm saying? I kind of knew that, you know what I'm saying, when I seen, you know what I'm saying, they played in the movie Disorderly, and not only that, Beach Boys, wipe out. I mean, they enjoy success on top of success at the expense of the real one with the talent. Which one is the real one with the talent, people? The real one with the talent is the one that had to leave this earth sooner than everybody else. That's the big, big one. That's the one that, oh, who, 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 you know, the big, big one. That's that one. I even, I seen that movie, Disorderlies, also. I enjoyed that movie. But the light-skinned one, you know what I'm saying, seemed to me to be the outcasted one. Not the outcasted one, but the one that, you know what I'm saying, has enjoyed all of the benefits because that's the one that did all the sacrificing. That's why he was able to go on and get an XM satellite radio show. I mean, this man, this man, you know what I'm saying, enjoyed the finer things in life while his co-members did not. I mean, you would think, right, if you guys grew up together... You, Prince Marky D, and the two other ones. If y'all grew up together, and then y'all became famous together, y'all signed a contract together, you would think that, okay, boom, you know what I'm saying? The fame done fell down, but you know what I'm saying? They want me. I'll put it like this. If we came into this game together, you know what I'm saying, and, and, and I'm picked you know what I'm saying? To do this and to do that. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to make sure I bring every last one of you all up. The fattest one to the fat, fat one. I'm going to make sure both of you fat boys come ride with me. We all going to be DJing in the club. We all going to have a serious satellite radio station. We all going to, you know what I'm saying, make more music, have solo career. We all going to do everything. But hey, it's not like that in this game. You know what I'm saying? This man died at 52. Backwards, that's 25. That's a ritualistic number. So that means he died. He killed his friend, the fat, fat one. You know who I'm talking about. That's the, the fattest one of the fat boys. He killed that one. And now, hmm, his demise is gone now. Now he just um, announced that he just... Sacrifice well, they just sacrifice him. That's crazy. But this this how it works, people. You know what I'm saying? This is the price of fame, people. You know what I'm saying? They said, you know what I'm saying? I see a lot of other, you know what I'm saying, media outlets doing reports on him and and, and not and, and not looking at the fact that he sacrificed the fat fat one. I don't know the fat, fat one's name. I'm just saying the fat, fat one because that was the fat, the fattest, the fattest one of the whole group. He sacrificed that boy. You know what I'm saying? I did the news report on it. It was some years ago. I did the news report on it. I, you know what I'm saying? 
But, um, yeah, Prince Marky D. Uh-oh. Okay, like I said, people. So, you know what I'm saying? So, that's going to wrap it up for this. You know what I'm saying? This is just a quick, quick video. I, you know what I'm saying? I'm, he sacrificed the little fat, fat one. So, that's why I don't really have no sympathy for uh, Prince Marky D. Because, you know what I'm saying? Hey. That's the price of fame. Why? How you think he rose to get his own XM satellite radio show? Why? Why? How do you think he rose to that? How you think he rose actually to get his solo career? How do you think he did that? None of the other ones had got their own solo career, have they? But anyway, this is news. Like I said, if you want to support this truth. You know what I'm saying? The Cash App link, the PayPal link in the description box below. I want to thank you all for tuning in and logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour. Right here on Illuminati Radio, I'm your host, I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. If you are new to this page, please hit channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when I drop this juicy news. Hit that like button if you're enjoying this content. And if you want to sow your seed into this, I mean, I mean, and if you want to, um... Join my exclusive Facebook Messenger group. You can do so by sending me a friend request to my Facebook page, which is PSTR, Michael Smith on Facebook. And I'll add you to the group. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you.